Today, I wanna to introduce you to someone that we've been partnering with during this current pandemic. This is Dr. Jay Fothy. He is our consulting physician. He's been working with us through the COVID-19 pandemic and has been giving us a lot of great direction throughout. I know the risk is lower outside versus inside. Why is that? Well, one of the ways the virus is transmitted is through the air. It's called different things by different doctors and different scientists. The bottom line is, if you're in an enclosed space for a long period of time and you're close to someone that has it, there's a much higher chance you're going to catch it than if you and I are standing apart like this, sitting apart like this outside. Your risk is not zero by any means when you're outside, but you're at much, much lower risk when you're outside. And I think you're seeing that in a lot of the recommendations. For example, restaurants in some communities opening up, socially distanced, outside only. Um, and some of the activities, I think, in some of your communities, outside visitation, for example, that's significantly safer than being inside. A lot of people I've heard have tested positive, but they're asymptomatic. What does that mean? Asymptomatic means you don't feel sick. You don't have any symptoms. So yes, we're learning a lot about this disease and this virus every day. And again, we're um, worldwide, there's a great collaboration going on in the medical and the scientific community and we're making headway every day. But there's no question, we know now, that people can have the coronavirus, COVID-19, and actually even be contagious for a period of time with it and not know it. So this is why we tell people, assume everyone you come across has it and doesn't know it, and assume that you might even be one of those people. We want to test people. We want more and more people to get tests. Initially, there wasn't enough testing supplies. Now there's much, a much more adequate supply. It is possible to have the disease and spread it to other people and not know it. It's just important to keep that in the back of your mind. And I think it helps inform all the things that we do from a safety standpoint. And one last thing about masks. The reason that we're not wearing masks right now is because number one, we're outside, and number two, we're more than six feet apart from each other. So we have that safe zone, and this is the way you can tell. But if we were inside or if we were closer, we'd be wearing masks. So please remember, don't be afraid to wear your mask. It's very important to protect yourself, but more importantly, to protect other people. Thank you so much, Dr. J. I really, really appreciate your time and your insight.